Hey guys, welcome back to some virtual reality games. We're here using the Vive to play a new game called The Blue. Now, my friend, my good friend Alex Turner, uh, <laughs> told me that this is the one game that made him take his headset off. It freaked him out so much that he had to just nope out of there and uh, and take off his headset and 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 just abandon it. So I'm going to rise to this challenge and see if I can play The Blue. So we want music on. What is that? Ambient, ambient on, sure. And inspection on. So there's the blue reef migration, the blue whale encounter, or the blue luminous abyss. So we're gonna start pretty cash and go for the reef migration, see what's up in the old land of the land of the reefs. Weather. Is that short for whatever? Oh man, now this is I don't know how we how we're supposed to move around. What's this? This is a stopwatch. Oh! So we can slow down time to just take a closer look. Some of these fishies. Hello, hello, Mr. Fishy. Oh, it's Dory. Hey, I found you. And we can take a picture with the left click. Oh, that's really cool. So we can pause time, trying to walk into a wall. Just take a picture of the fishy. There we go. Oh, looking good. All right, so, well, how do we move around then? Let's set time back to normal. Can I... Can I walk around? Is there, a, like, a translocator button? I don't think so. Do I swim? No, I don't swim. Oh, who's that? Who's this guy? Oh. Is he coming in? Is he coming in for a flyby? No, he's keeping a distance. Okay, well, let's just let's just try and stay very still. Let's see if he comes down for a for a little hello. Hello, Mr. Tidal, Mr. Tidal, please come say. Oh, he's he's not he's not sticking by, is he? If we pause time, we can take a closer look at him. If we don't walk into uh, the reef. Oh, there he goes. He might he might come by for another pass. Oh, in fact, I think he is. Here it, here it comes. Is he coming by? Oh. Now one of the things that Alex mentioned, uh, my friend, is that all the particles in the in the ocean distract you. And yeah, it feels like a very full ocean with these little bits of like stuff floating around. But ah, oh, the sunrise, the sunset behind that rock. That's a cute little fish over there. Hello. Come to say hello. Oh, yeah. Take a picture of you. Right, so, well, so what are the controls then? I'm pressing the triggers. Nothing is happening. Uh. Oh, what's this? Is this the menu? Oh, so we quit back out. All right, well, that's a quick look at the reef. I want to meet Mr. Whale. Now, this this could be some, some Moby Dick level stuff here. White whale, holy grail. Split your lungs and crack your oars when you see the white whale. All right, now, ah, oh, flashbacks. This is actually the demo that they used when they were showing off the Vive. You could actually walk around. Oh, just walked into something in real life. Sorry. <laughs> you could actually walk around this um, this ship in real life, and yeah, that's right, a whale appears. So let's see if we can spot him before he before he uh, jumps up on us. There's a, a ray. There he is! Oh my god, isn't he a beast? Look at that massive grin. He's like saying, Yee -hee, I hope you're liking your vibe. Yee -hee. Uh, very much so. Loving it. Look at that. He's eyeballing me. Are you eyeballing me, son? Are you eyeballing me? You eyeballing me? I wish I had a bow and arrow. I could just like pyong him. Oh, look at that. He's getting real close, isn't he? Is he looking at me? Oh, it's so cool, though. Oh, he's gonna get me. He's gonna get me with his fin. No, I'm okay. Woo. Uh oh. Oh, the tail! Watch out for the tail! Woo! Whoa! Oh, the sense of. Ah! Woo! 
The sense of scale on that tail. Pretty impressive. And that's it. Wow, that was the whole encounter. The whale. A whale's tail. All right, well, let's, uh, let's head back and check out the last of these. We want to check out the Luminous Abyss. Now, this is the one that Alex said scared him the most. It's apparently pitch black darkness. And uh, you don't know what's out there, but something is out there. Something is going to get you. So you get a torch. Oh, man. Oh, I see what he means. This is super freaking scary. Oh, the stuff. The stuff in my face. Like bits of tissue paper. I've got a torch. Something's out there. Something's gonna get me. This is super scary. I can- Oh, it's- oh, I'm inside like the giant skeleton of a- of a whale. What's that down there? Is that- It's a little anglerfish, I think, down there. Can't quite get to him. What else is around here? So this is the giant corpse, the giant carcass of a- Oh, what's this? Oh, it's a chair. Jet of a whale. Some crabs down there. Hello, buddies. What else have we got around here? Nothing up here. Going to come down and oh, lunge at me. Oh, I'm definitely getting a bit claustrophobic. In oh, what? Did you see movement? So does anything come at me? This is super scary. Ooh! It's a fish. <laughs> that is a fish. Oh yeah, this is like the whale's spine. Oh, there he is. Let's just hide the torch. I think he doesn't like the light. Come back here, little dude. Little dude. Hello? Can't quite get my head down there because it's out of bounds at the wall in this room. Anything else out there going to come and say hello? Oh, what's this? There's an extra button on my... Oh. So I can get two torches. Oh, no. I can change which one is the torch. Looks pretty peaceful so far. Oh, look, you can see him. Like, when you turn the torch off, you can see him bright as a diamond. Oh, that is a beautiful fish. He's got an ugly grin, but he's a beautiful fish. Let's go say hello. Whereabouts am I in the room? I think it should be okay. Slow down time. Oh, yeah. That's a pretty little beastie. Let's, uh, let's torch up. Oh, look at these fish! Slow down time because they're moving so quick. But oh, whoops, I'm gonna trip over here. Not sure where I am. Is that? Oh yeah, look at these glowing fish. They're beautiful. Let's have a closer look. Can't quite see. Oh, there's fish all around here actually. I wonder if you strobe it, you can like kind of almost make it feel like it's actually a lit up place. Oh yeah. It's definitely a rib cage that we're inside. Okay, let's get back up to speed. I'm not sure if anything else happens, but these whole things just play out, don't they? So, fingers crossed it'll just happen, if something's going to happen. Oh, all the fish are getting scared. Should we go over and say hello to Mr. Angler? Domo arigato, Mr. Angler. Oh, he looks amazing, doesn't he? Just turn off the light, actually. Get a better look at that glowing little ding-a-ling. <laughs> nice. Nice. Alright, well, let's pick up the pace. Whoa! Who's this? Oh, I don't want to touch it because this will be... I'm on my knees now. So, oh, wait. No, 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 no. Come back. Come back. Okay, I've slowed down time. So this is a jellyfish. That's amazing. I'm sat down on the floor now. Oh, okay, let's pick up the speed and watch him float away. Where'd he come from, though? He just appeared out of nowhere, didn't he? Oh, there's loads. Uh oh, there's loads of them. I might get stung if I'm not careful. Wait, they're coming out of the floor! Yeah, there's loads of them. Oops, that's the, that's the edge of the room. Oh, yeah, I don't even need a light now. These things have lit this place up completely. So this is... Oh, look at them in the distance! That is a sight to behold. Man, Alex was super scared that something was going to come out of the darkness like a giant squid and just rip his head off and drink his innards. But that didn't happen. You're okay, Alex. There's nothing wrong at all down here. Wait, hang on a sec. That is a hand. 
This isn't the corpse of a whale. It's the corpse of a giant! Oh, it's so lit up now, though. I've got no... Oh, God. I've got no lights on. I feel like that bit in Avatar when Jake gets attacked by seeds. Oh, all the fish. Everything just glows so much. If I want to have shine a torch up this... This, uh, this guy's caboose. Come on, get out of here. Can I push them around? I think I can. Yeah, I'm pushing them around. Ooh, ooh, I'm pushing them. I can eat them. Oh, ow. Just hit the, hit the face mask. Oh, God. So many fish. So what happens next? Is there going to be something comes out of me? I keep hearing a rumbling in the distance. And these fish are picking... Oh! Something scared them. Something... Oh my god. Something has scared the fish. Stay very calm. Very still. What's, what's going on? What's going on? Oh. Oh, and that was it. Well, that was a nice experience. Well, this has been The Blue. It's a new VR game. It's, well, oh, honestly, it's not a game. It's an experience. And I guess you guys have experienced it with me. It's quite immersive being there, but at the same time, uh, there's not a great deal to do. But I guess these guys have more experiences planned, so if the bottom of the sea isn't your bag, maybe they'll do like inside a volcano or on the moon. I'd like to go to the moon. So yeah, who knows? Anyway, join me next time for some more explorations into VR games, and hopefully uh, it'll be something that we can play a bit more rather than just experience. But I do keep my ear to the ground. I am kind of always looking out for awesome new VR games and experiences. So if there's anything that you guys want to see me do, make sure you do let me know, because I'm always open to suggestions. And until next time, guys, I hope you have a great day. Hope hope you are, if you've got a VR headset, I hope you're enjoying it. If you don't, uh, I hope you're enjoying my experiences and in some way having a VR headset through me. So until next time, guys, hit like and subscribe and take care.